I'm doing something pretty spontaneous. Okay, Q and A time. So, how was your first kiss? I want to get married now and have kids like now, but that's just me. <laughs> Hey guys, so I just wanted to start vlogging today because I'm doing something pretty spontaneous. Me and Laura are going to Cocoa Beach to watch the sunset and eat dinner. We literally didn't have anything to do today. We woke up so late, we like took showers really late, so now we're just like, what the heck are we gonna do? And I made it a goal to go at least once a month, but that didn't happen. But I need to charge my camera before I take it, so here be. Getting our snack bag ready over there. <laughs> Keep my popcorn, and I'm gonna eat my pasta from yesterday really quick because I didn't go to meal plan. We have my beach bag, towel, camera, GoPro. I brought my GoPro, we should totally use it today because I feel like I never use my GoPro. Then I brought my tripod, another jacket. I'm scared it's gonna be too cold. Do you have a jacket? Bring a jacket, okay. So we've started our drive to Cocoa Beach, Florida, and we have about an hour to go. We started at like 2.55 or something. That. I left like my good sunglasses at home, so sorry for the clashing. So I just opened up like my center console and it's filled with like lipsticks and just chapsticks and everything. It literally looks so pretty. I was like, what the f you literally have Sephora in here. <laughs> also, I changed my sunglasses because <laughs> Laura, Laura said I was clashing, so. We're going over a bridge, hold your breath. I used to do that all the time when I was little. Oh, really? And I would get really scared. We made it. Woo! Now we can get out of this car. Paying for parking. I don't know why it's taking so long though. I'm so glad we did this. Same. It's so gorgeous. Just having a little photo shoot. My hair got too crazy. Q&A time, guys. I didn't get a lot of questions just because it was kind of short notice, but <laughs> half of them are from my friends and they're probably gonna be really stupid, inappropriate questions, so. Okay, somebody asked me, do you have a middle name? I do, mine is Sonali. I, <laughs> I didn't even get that. <laughs> my middle name is Mary and I'm Catholic, so that's kind of why it's like Indian, American, Indian, uh -huh. you know. Sonali, Mary, Prabhu. It kind of sounds weird, but that was my mom's middle name, and my sister got my grandma's middle name, which was Anne. What about you? Um, she's so, a cool one. No, I don't. Yes. Okay, well, I have like a second first name, and that's Zainab, and then my actual middle name is Gonzalez, which is my mom's maiden name. Oh, yeah. I did not know that. Margaret, you're mean. <laughs> um, do you want to get married to Ryan? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I want to ring on my finger right now, right where you at. <laughs> no, I'm serious. <laughs> He's a good dude. Good dude, man. Keep good, good. dudes around. I right? know. Does she want to get married to Antonio? No. What? Yes, of course. <laughs> like, I don't know. I feel like we wouldn't be dating, dating them him if we didn't, to. like, see that. You know what I mean? True. And, you know, anything could happen. Like, we're not going to be like, you know, like, if I don't marry him, like, I will, like, like yeah but like i mean life happens so we're just trying to cruise along we're only sophomores in college so i mean we can dream we can pinterest everything that we want but right now it's not gonna happen unfortunately because i want to get married now and have kids like now but that's just me <laughs> your go-to makeup products i don't know like if i was stranded on an island and couldn't like only had to take like two things i'd probably take like mascara and um, like concealer because like I don't really need foundation and if I just put co concealer under my eyes It like almost looks like I'm wearing foundation. One of my favorite products right now is this Ofra highlighter It's Beverly Hills. It is popping. Guys. It's always popping it's and I literally, literally so before this I had um, Laura Geller Gilded Honey and like yeah that had like a really nice shine but like it's it doesn't pop on me for some reason and like everyone else uses it yeah. like it's in every other like beauty video but I don't know so the Ofra ones actually like pop, pop. <laughs> and they're not chunks of glitter 
because I have the Urban Decay Illuminated one, and that's literally glitter on your face, which sometimes I like. I like glitter, <laughs> but sometimes. But no, Ofra is hands down amazing, and like I can't go a day without it now. So that's definitely one of my very first favorite products right now. What about you? I'm not as into makeup as Sonali is, um, but I've really been loving my Morphe palette. Oh yeah, she got the 350. Yeah, I just got the matte yeah. one, oh, so it's it. like my favorite thing ever. Because, I need to add that to my birthday list. <laughs> yeah, like, I don't know, I just like it because like I'm more of a matte person when it comes to eyeshadows because yeah. glitter just doesn't look good on me. I know. But yeah. um, it's very, I'm super into matte too right yeah. now. Sometimes I miss glitter and I'll be like, oh my god, I have so many glitter eyeshadows, mm -hmm. like let's just do a glitter eye. Yeah. But that's like the only reason I'll wear it because I just know that matte looks so much better on me. Yeah, I'm jealous i actually do have that on my birthday list so ryan <coughs> morphe 350 matt what is your favorite activity that you guys like to do <laughs> be spazzes in our apartment literally yes that's my favorite thing that we do our rooftop photo shoot yes oh Definitely. yes on top of our like apartment you probably saw it in like other vlogs but we like to go on top of our rooftop and take pictures and last formal me and Ryan took pictures she took pictures of us and um, somebody was like oh did you go to like a lake to take those pictures and like it was literally on top of like my apartment building but thanks for thinking that so it looks like really cool yeah. it looks like edgy but kind of like nice background yeah this was like our first spontaneous thing ever like yeah. coming to coco beach on a wednesday like what the so heck so random yeah i was just like we don't have anything to do today let's just go to coco beach i'll drive and um yeah we need to do more stuff like this spontaneous stuff but i'm not spontaneous like i have to plan out every single thing in my life so because i didn't have anything to do i was like okay <laughs> i'll be spontaneous just for this one day <laughs> And that's it of my Snapchat Q&A. That was so long. Thank you guys for asking me questions. I know it was like really short notice, so that's why I didn't really get a lot of questions, but I, I have a this. question for yeah. you. Okay. okay. So how was your first kiss? My first kiss was everything in my life I feel like is anticlimactic. We don't talk about that anymore. What about you? Okay, well, <laughs> my first kiss actually happened last year hey. to Antonio, right? To Antonio, <laughs> and it was super awkward. I think, like, wait, where was it? In my bedroom. Oh, damn, that is awkward. I yeah. feel like, but like, I feel like my whole life, I wanted my whole like my first kiss to be so perfect. Yeah. So there yeah. have been times where it could have happened to like yeah. elementary boyfriends <laughs> or like middle school boyfriends. Yeah. But like. I just didn't want it to happen then because yeah. like that's not what I want it to be Aww, and I just I think you have to realize like it's not going to be perfect no so you have to make never. it be stupid you know yeah. what I mean yeah just like I don't want to say like get it over with but like don't be scared yeah us, definitely you know? what's our em most embarrassing thing that we've ever done like with each other like summer be or like from now I can't I can't even think of it okay my most embarrassing thing I don't know if she, she told you guys yet but like okay in summer B, <laughs> I was so spazzy because we literally never left. Like, she wasn't even my roommate, but like, she always came over. But we never left my dorm. And so we were always just, like, so, like, like spazzy. And um, so I was, like, trying to do, like, a cheerleading move, like a scorpion. I, I don't even know what it's called. No, On top no, of a chair, no, just, though. like, the one leg up. Yeah. A lib, lib. Um, so, yeah. On top of a chair. And it literally fell over and it was like a high chair it was not like low chair it was a high chair and it, it fell over and literally she has the worst I have scar like ever such a big <laughs> scar on my chin because like i ate shit like <laughs> oh my god it was so bad um and then i like ran away well you can tell this story okay i feel like it's funny when you <laughs> so sonali like I think whenever she gets like embarrassed or hurt, this yeah. has happened a lot actually, <laughs> where she just runs away from like you, and I'm like, okay, whatever. And so she like leaves for a while, and I'm like, oh, I want to see how Sonali's doing. <laughs> so I go into her room, and she's like, FaceTiming Ryan, and like she starts crying, and I got so confused because I was like, I thought they had like an issue with their relationship, yeah. 
but it, in reality, it was literally her crying about her boo boo. Yeah. And well, so- it didn't even hurt at the time, but when I put ice on it, it stung so bad that I like started bawling my eyes out. So it was like, don't tell anyone. And I was like, okay, I'm sorry, bye. And I was kind of embarrassed too. So I feel like I don't get embarrassed. Yeah. That easily. Because you're crazy. Pub. That was embarrassing. Oh yeah, she broke her heel. No, it was like a wedge, right? Yeah. She I... broke her wedge. How do you break a wedge? It did, Let me know. Yeah. Let I me know. Don't I don't understand. know. But the thing is, I kept dancing for like three hours, and then I realized it was fun though. Yeah, it was a fun time. But all you UCF people never wear wedges to pub. It's not a thing. I don't know why we did ever. I literally wore wedges like twice, and no one ever told me like, "What are you doing? Like, you're not supposed yeah. to wear that." So like, I just like wore them. So what do you wear now? Just sandals. Oh really? Yeah. Because like they're gonna get ruined anyway. Yeah, so, like you're gonna get like every time I come home from like pub or lib, my feet are like black <laughs> from bar tar and it's disgusting. That sunset's really pretty. Weirdest fact about you. Oh, I have a good one. Um, I can literally pick up anything with my toes. <laughs> I've done it so many times this is all like look <laughs> Okay. Let's see this. <laughs> All right. So pick gonna... up that speaker right there. Well, no. Like... No. No, that's easy. Yeah. This is hard. Yeah. Well, this uh-huh. is like not even. Uh-huh. <laughs> that was a fail. She <laughs> lied. <laughs> okay. What was a weird fact about you? You already know, bro. You what? already know. I eat kernels for a living. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> a living. Really. No, though. literally anytime I make popcorn, she's like, Save me some. <laughs> She's like, I'm running out on my like bag of kernels. <laughs> I think I brought it. I think it's in the car actually. <laughs> and I brought popcorn just to eat the kernels. And I saw this life hack at on Haley Williams channel. I don't know if you guys watch her, but she like does DIYs. And one of the life hacks was like, if you don't want the kernels, like poke a hole in the bag and like it comes out. And I'm like, girl, I want the kernels. I just want. I just want the kernels. So I'm gonna do that hack next time. Just kidding. I mean, I like popcorn. Like, it's yummy when you put garlic salt on it. Really quick, I wanted to mention my outfit. I got this sweater at Forever 21, but like, literally, I ripped it so bad that I like put it all the way down. Like, it was literally like a sweater like this, but I like ripped it because there's like a hole in the back. Can you see it? It's right here. Yeah. There's like a hole in the back, so I was like, okay. Actually, this was the front, so I switched this to the front, but this actually has the tag on it. And I just DIY'd a shirt real quick, and I pushed Good. it down. And then I'm wearing, like, flowy pants from Tilly's. And everyone was asking where my choker was for F21. What about you? Where's your... <laughs> I'm just wearing a bathing suit. Well, I am wearing a bathing suit. Well, I guess it's fitting. We're at the beach, True. so... You can make um, that your excuse. Um, I'm wearing this necklace that... Antonio got me. And then I'm <laughs> Tell wearing the meeting. Put it on my hand. Wow, so YouTuber. <laughs> I know. It just is the date in Roman nu- Roman numerals uh-huh. of our like the first time we started dating, mm-hmm. like our anniversary date. Mm-hmm. And he actually got it for me for our one year. So, so cute. Little girls. <laughs> oh, my top is from Ross because that's where your girl shops all the time, and it just has these really cool flowy sleeves, butterfly arms. Mm-hmm. And then I'm just wearing some leggings from Forever 21. We totally forgot to eat Cheetos while we were talking to you guys. <laughs> all that garlic beans. You thought we were done with pictures? Now we're on to boomerangs. <laughs> Two, three. <laughs> just got to the place we're eating dinner at. It's Jazzy's Mainly Lobster. About to get some lobster rolls maybe. I'm gonna get the lobster roll. I found these vintage cards. They're so vintage. So vintage. <laughs> what? These are like fifty dollars. Yeah. TV. I don't even know these shows. They're so old. But actually, <laughs> like this, I don't even know any of these. I'm gonna quiz you. I don't know any of this. You don't know. Okay, this just has to do with baby baby boobers. What? Oh, baby boomer? Baby boomers? You're not gonna that. Yeah. <laughs> like, all this is so, like, outdated, I feel like. Yeah. Look how good this looks. Okay. 
We are almost home. It was such a fun day. Very fun. It wasn't even the whole day, but it was like, yeah. <laughs> it, was a good, it was a good end to our day. It was fun. But like the restaurant, like the food was like, okay, like whatever, good, whatever. I, uh, it wasn't as good as I wanted it. Like, yeah, I know. It just like wasn't like the best. And like, mm -hmm. especially because like it was just like, not disgusting inside. It just like was not aesthetically pleasing, yeah. you know? And like when you go to like a nice restaurant on the beach, you want it to be like pretty and like, I don't know, like yeah, it nice. Wasn't even beachy. It was like more yeah. geared towards like older people that hunt or something. I don't know. It just like looked like we were in the middle of nowhere. So I'm just chilling in bed eating kernels. What's new? Samantha. Samantha's here as well. And also I did redid my board. But okay. What is everyone's favorite Thanksgiving food? I like green bean casserole. That's my favorite. I like sweet potato casserole. Green bean casserole! <laughs> <laughs> what do you like? Sweet potato casserole! Oh, they're both good. I forgot about green beans. Marshmallows? Green. Yeah, yeah. Uh, when yeah. Put in a boiler. See, I was gonna say that. Sweet, sweet, sweet potato one. I don't know. I really like the turkey with the cranberry sauce. I love turkey in general. I though. like turkey, but I don't like cranberry sauce. What? I always throw that shit out. It's so no. like tart. Oh, or like, like what is it? Stuffing? I love stuffing too. Oh yeah, stuffing's really good. Like. My dad literally dad said, "Hey, I think this year for Thanksgiving I'm just gonna get pizza and chicken." Oh. Uh, I think not. Literally after Thanksgiving, I crave it all the time. I wish I had. Thanksgiving leftovers. Well, my favorite part about Thanksgiving is like the leftovers and making sandwiches out of it. Like taking the biscuit, put some gravy and mashed potatoes with your turkey, some stuffing. It's it's usually like an earl like a late lunch, early dinner. So around like two is when we eat. Yeah, no, we have ours at like one or two. It's yeah. so weird. I would expect it to be a like dinner, dinner time. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. The only holiday we actually have dinner at the right time is like Christmas Eve. Yeah. Christmas Day even, we eat at like 12. Good night, people of the world. Bye. Say it. You're gross. Get out of my room. Get out of my room. You're gross.